Here's another set of new navigation page banners for the Suppress Histories archives. We'll be making these resources on global women's history easier to explore with links to thousands of photo essays. Examining domination by sex, racialized caste, class, and conquest is crucial to women's history research. All these are material systems of exploitation. We look at historical patterns of rape, abduction, and marriage by capture, battering women, the sexual double standard with its female restraints, punishments, and ordeals. Religious texts and laws are one way to institutionalize and spread women's suppression. State law codes are another, but patriarchal customs are often unwritten. Physical constraints, bindings, and mutilations of women's bodies are imposed in many ways, including dress, public humiliation like witches' bridles, or electroshock torture and drugging. The common people get pushed down into servitude over time, heavy labor in mines, fields, and factories, as underpaid peons, starved and despised by their oppressors. Military attack is a primary way of subjugating countries or communities with looting, rape, killings. Later, the survivors are forced to pay tribute to the new rulers. Taking captives is a major pattern of warfare. In early history, female captives primarily, later males as the scale of slave trading increases. Rape is built into war and slavery. Following seizure of territory by military force, influxes of foreign settlers kill and expel the original peoples or force them into subjugated classes without rights, breaking treaties. Colonization along with slave trafficking gives rise to racialized hierarchies that violate the rights of peoples who are now classified as subjugated on the basis of their ethnicity and appearance alone and kept down that way. White supremacists work these ideologies into history, anthropology, and science, attempting to justify the systemic injustices. They explain them as inferiority, incapacity, and negated the actual history of the world. One of the most erased subjects of history is genocide. The slaughter of indigenous populations or of other persecuted peoples. Methods include paying bounties for body parts, smallpox pox blankets, well poisonings, and destruction of the food supply. Scorched earth tactics. The slaughter of women is a historic pattern that is still prevalent. Wife murder, dowry murders, serial killers, and a deep and wide current of killing girl babies at birth. Boy preference historically funneled girls into the maw of sex trafficking, but so has social rejection of sexually abused girls, the predatory trickery of pimps and the economic coercion of poverty. Blaming women as evil magical harm doers is a widespread historical pattern but the witch persecutions that exploded in Europe ingrain misogynist stigma into the culture that is still harming women today. Other forms of persecutory culture, pogroms and the blood libel aimed at Jews, as charges of cannibalism were used against native peoples, attacks on religious and ethnic minorities, lynching, stoning of women for adultery, it's a long list. Many of these persecutory tropes originated in state persecution of older ethnic religions, especially under Christian regimes, which defined them as devil worshipers. The demonologies that grew out of those repressions were increasingly racialized with black devils and white angels, 
and they loaded in pornographic tropes of women having sex with devils, one of the main accusations in the witch hunts. Demonization of African, American, Asian, Pacific, and Australian people exploded in popular culture during the age of European imperialism. It's popular culture. And the witch hunts branded misogyny into every corner of European culture, from elite scholarly works to popular media. If this is important to you, for this knowledge to get out, you can donate and help reconfigure the Suppress Histories website, adding 10,000 already existing pages, formatting and hyperlinking them to navigation pages, which will all eventually be tagged to make the site searchable. The top link here allows you to securely donate via credit card, or if you prefer mail checks made out to the Suppress Histories archives to the address shown here. Thank you in advance for your donations and support.